Did the Apostle Paul teach that the Ten Commandments did not exist until Mount Sinai? This is what we're going to be talking about in today's daily devotionals. It's July 26th. Um, it's, we're talking about the Ten Commandments. Um, again, the question is, does the Apostle Paul teach that the Ten Commandments did not exist until Mount Sinai? July 26th. Here we go. For until the law... Sin was in the world, but sin is not imputed when there is no law. Romans 5 verse 13. Some teach that the phrase until the law here means that the law did not exist between Adam and the time of Moses. But the balance of the text, coupled with Romans 4 and verse 15, proves just the opposite because the law brings about wrath. For where there is no law, there is no transgression. If there was no law, when Cain killed his brother, it wouldn't have been a sin. Yet Genesis 4 verse 7 speaks uh, of sin lying at the door. It's interesting to see references to God's law before the Ten Commandments were given on Mount Sinai. Note how God rebuked his people. The Lord said to Moses, How long do you refuse to keep my commandments and my laws? In Exodus 16 verse 28. Evidently, there was a basic understanding of God's law already. Um, people were punished for breaking any one of the commandments before Sinai, um, in indicating that the law existed and sin was imputed. God also honored Abraham, um, who kept his commandments, statutes, and laws in Genesis 26 and verse 5. The law did not exist in written form prior to Sinai. I believe that this is uh, Pastor Doug Bachelor talking. Pastor B Doug Bachelor believes, with the uh, incredible mind, um, with the incredible minds God gave people before the flood, there was no need to write down the law. Um, as the Lord walked with Adam and Eve in the garden, He taught them His law. When sin came and they removed from, they were removed from Eden. The Lord further explained the sacrificial system. Our first parents simply passed along these truths verbally. Now, here's a list of the Ten Commandments before Mount Sinai. The first commandment um, is mentioned in Genesis 35 verses 2 through 4. You guys can look this up. The second commandment is mentioned in Genesis 31 uh, verses 19 through 34. The third commandment was uh, mentioned in Genesis 12 and verse 3. The fourth commandment uh, in Exodus 16 and verse 26. The fifth commandment in Genesis 9 verses 20 to 25. The sixth commandment in Genesis 4 verses 8 through 15. The seventh commandment, Genesis 39 verses 7 through 9. The eighth commandment, Genesis 44 verses 8 through 16. The ninth commandment, Genesis 27 verses, uh, verse 12. And the 10th commandment, Genesis 25, verses 29 through 34. And then also Genesis 27, verses 1 through 45. So these are all the lists of the 10 commandments being mentioned before Mount Sinai. Israel had lost sight of the principles of God's law while in Egypt or while in Egyptian bondage. So God wrote the law with his own finger to bring it back to mind. So... A lot of people are going to, um, excuse me. A lot of people are going to misread or, I guess, misinterpret um, a lot of things in the Bible, and a lot of times, people are so um, into their ways and stuck in their ways. Where, uh, when it comes to the law, uh, especially the Sabbath, they want to make up all kinds of excuses not to keep the sabbath especially and so they say things like well the sabbath was never mentioned in the in the uh before this you know the giving of the law in mount sinai so why should we keep it actually it was mentioned um before mount sinai in exodus 16 um so not only that but it was also mentioned in genesis anyway the seventh day sabbath the, the sabbath rest was mentioned in uh, Genesis, um, Genesis one, 
Genesis 2. Uh, and then also um, the fact that the, the fourth commandment says to remember the Sabbath, meaning there must have been something that happened before God wrote the law uh, where we have to remember the Sabbath. You get what I'm saying? So why would he uh, command us to remember the Sabbath if the Sabbath was not important before my, Mount Sinai? So this is just... Uh, this is just something to think about. Again, today's date, July 26th. Again, talking about the Ten Commandments. That is today's daily devotional. Thank you guys for coming through and being here with me. If you guys were blessed by this daily devotional, please like and share. Share with your friends, with your family, your coworkers, your relatives, anybody who you know would be blessed by this daily devotional. You guys are just as much part of this um, ministry as I am. And if you guys are new to this channel, want more Christian content, want more daily devotionals and daily Bible reading, please subscribe and also make sure to hit the bell so that you guys can be notified every time Inspired by God YouTube channel uploads another video. And if you guys uh, are inspired to support this ministry, you can do so by praying for this online video ministry and also donating at schoolforprofits.tv. We will use the donation um, to... Uh, make more Bible study films and Bible study videos and also to advertise these videos so that we can reach more people. Thank you guys again. Praise God always. I'll see you guys next time. Or actually, I'll see you guys on the Discord. Link is in the description.